afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. I hope you're having a wonderful time and welcome to the first Sunday in the month of November. I am so excited to have you today for another wonderful Bible adventure. It promises to be so wonderful and exciting. I want to show you two things that, might, that will point you to what we are going to be discussing today. Here I have two materials. One is shiny, one is darker. What color are these? Can you tell me? Can anyone tell me? Did you say this is black? Wow, perfect. You're so intelligent. And this color? It's gold. Wow, clap for yourself. That's wonderful. Don't worry. I'm going to be telling you a lot more about these two when we come back. First of all, let us put our hands together and say a word of prayer. Hands together, eyes closed, and heads bowed. In Jesus' name. Father, thank you for another time in your presence. We pray that you help us to listen, to learn, and to have a wonderful time in your presence. Thank you, Heavenly Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Now, before we continue, let's go praise the Lord and shake our bodies in praise to the Lord. Your love has captured me. 
You know it, right? Let's do it together. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. Continue. I told you that I was going to tell you about the gold and the dark. Now we're going to be talking about two different places. The first place is a beautiful place that I am showing you in the gold material. It's a lovely place. It's a place that is so colorful, a place filled with joy, celebration, happiness. And do you know what that place is called? I'm going to tell you. It's called heaven say with me heaven heaven is a lovely place and do you know who is in heaven did you say god is in heaven yes you're very right god is in heaven jesus is in heaven do you want to go to heaven i sure want to go to heaven how do you get to heaven you get to heaven by being a friend of jesus if jesus is your friend God is your father, then you're surely going to heaven. Praise the Lord. Now, apart from that, 
You need to be good boys and girls to go to heaven. Remember when we talked about our Say No series? Our series on Say No. Say No to bullying, say no to fighting, say no to lying, say no to cheating, you know? All those bad things, when you say no to them and you don't do them, then you will go to heaven because then Jesus will be your friend. The, the heaven is so lovely, it's shiny, it's colorful, the roads are in gold and that's why I decided to show you this shiny material. I'm still going to show you the picture of heaven that I have. But before then, let's talk about the other place, the sad, dark place that nobody wants to go. That place is called hell. Nobody wants to go to hell. Hell is a very sad place. It's a place for bad people. You know, those people that don't say no to cheating, they don't say no to bullying, they don't say no to lying, they don't say no to cheating, they don't say no to fighting. Those that do a lot of bad things, they will go to hell. Jesus is not their friend. God is not their father. That is not us. We are going to heaven. Say with me, children. I am going to heaven. Great. Say it again. I am going to heaven. Wonderful. Clap for yourselves. Wow. I love that. Now, before we continue, I want to show you the picture of heaven that I have. It's a lovely picture. Here. Yeah. Wow. Can you see how colorful it is? Can you see the children playing? Some people are singing. Can you see the streets of gold? Wow, so lovely and colorful. I know I want to go to heaven and I'm sure you want to go to heaven as well. Don't worry, as far as Jesus is your friend, God is your father and you're doing good. You don't fight with your brothers or your friends and you're nice to your neighbors. You give, you know, you're obedient. You're not stubborn. You love Jesus then you will go to heaven. This is another picture of heaven that I have here. Take a look at it. Can you see how Jesus is welcoming his children into heaven? Yes, Jesus has gone to prepare a wonderful place for us in heaven. And when our time here is done, when we are old and gray, right, we'll go to heaven and we'll be with Jesus in heaven. Praise the Lord. Now let me show you the picture of the sad place called hell. Here it is. No one wants to go here. It's a sad place. There's a lot of crying, a lot of sorrow and sadness. No one wants to go to hell. We are not going to hell. We are sure going to heaven. The colorful, lovely place. Good. Now remember I told you if you want to go to heaven, then you have to be good. No fighting, no bullying, no cheating, no lying, no stealing, no stubbornness, no disobedience. And of course, we will go to heaven. Praise the Lord. Now, for your creativity time, I want you to think of something that will remind you of heaven. For me, I'm going to use this gold material, and it will remind me that the streets of heaven are in gold color. Yes. So whenever I see this, I remember heaven, and it, remind, it reminds me to be a good child, to be a good boy, to be a good girl. Now think of anything that will make you remember heaven. It could be an angel, whatever it is, you can get that and paste in your room. So when you see it, it will help you to remember that we are all going to heaven and we are going to have a wonderful time together with Jesus. Praise the Lord. Now our memory verse is simple. It's taken from the book of Hebrews, chapter 10, and verse 23. Say with me again, Hebrews, chapter 10, and verse 23. What does it say? It says, let us hold firmly to the hope that we have confessed. We can trust God to do what he promised. Again, together, let us hold firmly to the hope that we have confessed. We can trust God to do what he promised. Should we say that again for the last time? Hebrews chapter 10 and verse 23. Let us hold firmly to the hope that we have confessed. We can trust God to do what he has promised. Praise the Lord. I hope you had a wonderful time and I want you to go and tell your friends about heaven 
about how we can get to heaven and how wonderful heaven is. And for those of us that we have not yet accepted Jesus as our friend, I want us to pray together and so that Jesus can come into your life and you'll be good boys and good girls. Now let's pray. Eyes closed, hands together, and heads bowed. In Jesus' name. Father, I pray for my friends this morning, this afternoon, and this evening, wherever they may be. I pray, Heavenly Father, that you come into their lives, Jesus. They are accepting you this morning, this afternoon, and this evening as their Lord, as their Savior. Come and be their friend, Jesus. And thank you, Father, in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Now we are all friends of Jesus, and we can all look forward to going to heaven. Okay, children, I want you to tell your friends, your brothers and your sisters about heaven and what you imagine heaven will look like, okay? All right. Now, until I come your way next time, it's bye for now.